Hey lovely people! Tomorrow is Valentine's Day. It is a holiday that is very controversial. A lot of people agree with it, a lot of people don't agree with it. A lot of people just can't wait for the next day when all the chocolate is discounted. If you are someone who does not give a flying fuck about Valentine's Day, then you can click off this video. But if you are somebody who loves Valentine's Day, or is just somebody who celebrated it before, or is in a relationship, or just wants to give love to a friend, or whatever it is, if you're like totally fine with it, then I have a video for you. So I'm basically just gonna be showing you guys some things that you can give to your significant other, to your mom, to your dad, to your hamster. They're really easy and simple. Not all of them you can give to your mom and your dad, but your mom can give it to your dad, or your dad can give it to your mom, or your mom can give it to your mom, or your dad can give it to your dad. So the first gift idea is probably one of the easiest ones and the less expensive. Love quotes in a jar. Basically, you can get a mason jar, you can get a small box, you can get one of those like Chinese boxes or any other type of box and you can use like construction paper, regular paper, post-it notes, you can get creative and use like our origami paper, origami, origami, organic paper, organic, I don't know how to say that. But you take that and you get like a sharpie, you can get a black one or a pink one or I don't really, it doesn't matter as long as you can see it. The right things about the person that you like, it could be like friendly, it can be completely platonic, it can be super sexual, it could be like whatever it is that you want because it's for that person and it's a very thoughtful idea and whenever somebody is feeling like you know a little down about themselves all they gotta do is open up that jar open take that lid off the lid 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 take out one of those things and they feel like a thousand times better post-it notes you can kind of get creative with this you can put it all over the fridge you can put it all over the bed but it's basically kind of the same thing as the jar, except it's more just on the day. I mean, the person could keep the post-it notes. I would keep the post-it notes, but, you know, it's more for on the day if you want to be cutesy, you know. I don't got no post-it notes, so I'm, a show I'm not going to show you that shit. But it's also a very nice way to just say, hey, I love you, I think you're the shit, and I'm glad that we do things inappropriately. <laughs> Now this gift idea is definitely not something that you can send to your parents. But if you want to get a little more personal, if you know how to use a camera, if you know how to edit, and you want to just like send your man or your girl or your, um, your, you know, like if you're in an open relationship and like you're dating like more than two people, you know, that too. But you just set up your camera, right? You get like anything that is like sexy and sultry and you do your makeup all nice and you just like show them what they're gonna be getting on that day you know what i'm saying do it do it do it do it now lick it good suck this pussy just like you should sexy photos can also be included or if you're not someone who knows how to edit or use a camera and you just are really good at taking photos all you gotta do is put that timer on put your favorite lingerie on or gown or however you want to make them be like oh same things apply just pose feel confident and just like you can even print them out make them into a fucking calendar that's a great idea actually i would do that if you imagine this segment of the video is called cute puns this is the part that you can send to your crush you know i just want you to know that you're my butter hat you know baby a lot of people don't do this, but you, <laughs> oh, you light up my life. Hey, sweetie, so, uh, <laughs> that's Valentine's Day. I'm gonna touch your butt. You touched the butt? I'll make you ink this Valentine's Day. You can put your hands on my brindle. My drafts aren't the only thing I like rough. <laughs> Let's just say you're the Obi-Wan for me. Another way that you can show your significant other or whoever that you love them and they mean so much to you is just by playing songs that kind of explain how you feel about them. Personally, me, I love to serenade everyone. People get annoyed within the 20th second, but you know what? I don't give a fuck. Can we, we 
Amber Num Nums is never sexy. I'm a fucking dork. And that's how it's always gonna stay. But you know what? I rock that shit. <laughs> okay, maybe just one more. At the end of the day, as long as the person knows that you love them and you care about them 365 days of the year, and this day is just like a bonus, you know what I mean? Regardless of how you see it, this day can also... Try again, Amber. Regardless of how you see this day, there's a lot of beautiful things that do happen. Regardless if you see it as like a day to make more money or you just don't like it because you're single and you feel lonely. You don't have to be lonely just because you're single. Fucking go have fun and go hug some pandas or something. I, I mean, I don't know. But my biggest advice is to use this day to just give people a little bit of extra love. Just like a little bit extra love. If you're already somebody who gives a whole bunch of love, personally me, I love to give people love because love is the best form of love. L for love. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It was fun for me to make. Let me know what other videos you want me to do. I have a whole bunch of ideas cooking up and I'm really excited about it. 2017 is going to be a wonderful year and I hope you all have a wonderful Valentine's Day. Live it up, sex it up, eat it up. I love you all so much. Comment, subscribe, tell all your friends do all of things. Bye, bye, bye. I'm very musical today. That's just, that's what's happening. <laughs>